welcome to Damascus uh, educational uh, platform. Uh, we are here to take a grammar lesson. It's for the eighth grade, unit two. Uh, it's talking about past symbol and past continuous. Let's see the aims of our lesson. Use past symbol to fill uh, the gaps. Make questions using past symbol. Answering questions using past symbol. Completing uh, sentences using past continuous. Make and write sentences using when and why. Uh, look at this sentence. Yesterday I saw a good film. What's the tense of this sentence? You have to look at the verb. So, is it verb one or verb two? It's verb two. It's talking about uh, past uh, event. I saw a good, a good film. Um, is this action completed, finished, or uncompleted? It's completed action. When at present or at past, it's at past. We have the key or the adverb yesterday. It's past symbol. We use past symbol to talk about completed actions or habits and facts in the past. For example, um, I went to school when I was young. Now I'm not going to school because I'm not a student anymore. Uh, what is the form of bus symbol? We start uh, the sentence with subject, then we use verb to with bus symbol, then complement or rest of the sentence. We have two kinds of verb to, either regular verb uh, ended with ed, like a play, played, uh, live, lived, or irregular, like drink, drunk, go, went, see, seen, so, um, swim, swam. What are the keys of bus symbol? What are the adverbs of this uh, tense? We have yesterday, ago, last month, last Monday, last o October, whatever. Or in 1984, bus date. Or maybe you can use bus event. For example, uh, ancient pyramids. Now, we have this. Uh, exercise one in your uh, activity book write what they did yesterday we have the key here yesterday use bus symbol form of these verbs we have not meet eat not eat uh, it's negative what do we use with bus symbol in negative form we use what did you we use did plus verb one write uh, the boss is wrote, give, gave, not win, didn't, win, buy, bought, come, came, read, read, take, took, go, went, watch, watched, is, it's uh, regular. Elmer and his sister watch TV, it's answered. My father, the newspaper, what did my father do? Yes, he, he read. The newspaper. Sousan and I pizzas. Pizza. What did we do? We didn't eat pizzas. The teacher uh, us homework. What did the teacher gave us homework? Firas an email. What did he do? He wrote an email. Hind the race. Race. It's what didn't win the race. Didn't win. Verb one, not one. My friend and I some pens and pencils at the shop. What? We bought. I bought. Munzer and his friends to school. Yes. What did they do? They went to school. My aunt to our house. Yes. Came to our house. I some photos. I took some photos with my mom. Let's see exercise two. Write questions and answers. Uh, we talked about negative form. We use didn't plus verb one. 
What about question or interrogative? We use did, subject, then verb one. Remember to use verb one whenever you use did. It's a common mistake. Where they go last weekend? We have to make this sentence a question. Where did they go last weekend? This is the question. The answer should be in the bus symbol because we asked in the bus symbol, we use bus symbol. They went to Balmera. What's the bus of go? It's went. They went to Balmera. What your sister buy at the shopping mall? Yes, what did your sister buy at the shopping mall? She bought a CD. Look, we use did in the question plus verb one and the subject here. The answer is bought. Bought. Don't use bust with present. Bust, bust. How you get to the beach how did you get to the beach how did you reach to the beach i went by bus now if you want you can uh, write five sentences about last week in your notebook it's a good exercise for you now we have this sentence i was playing tennis yesterday morning What's the tense here? Is it present or past? I was. It's past. Is it uh, in progressive form? Yes, it is in progressive form, but at past, in past, not at present. It's called past continuous. We use the form of this sentence is subject plus was, where, and verb ing. Was, we use was with he, she, it, and I, where, with they, you, we. Remember to use was with I, not where. It's a common mistake. We use was continuous for an action that was in progress for a period of time, not for a long time. Yesterday morning, a period of yesterday. Let's see exercise four. This is a timetable about yesterday's timetable and complete the sentence. At AM, yes, what uh, they were ta uh, taking, they were studying what? English. At 9 AM, what they were studying? Yes, they were studying science at 9 AM. At information technology at 12 uh, quarter to 12 p.m. they were studying information technology IT at 1 p.m. they were studying math yes at 1 p.m. they were studying math uh, exercise 5 at uh, they were studying history at 10 30 or half past 10 a.m. they were studying history at 9 30 they were studying Arabic. Uh, I was, look at this sentence, I was playing tennis when I broke my leg. We have two actions here. I was playing tennis. It's what? It's boss continuous. When I broke my leg, it's what? What the tense here? Broke, it's boss seven. We have two actions. Uh, I was playing tennis. I broke my leg. One action interrupted the other. Which Action interrupted the other. I broke my leg. Interrupting was playing. So I didn't continue playing tennis because I broke my leg. We have two actions bus continuous plus bus symbol. The bus symbol actions, action happened in the middle of the bus continuous. Uh, we have bus continuous in the middle of it, ha a bus symbol happened. While it was in progress, the bus symbol interrupted the bus continuous. It's very important for, for you for uh, the ninth grade. Keep it in mind. Bus symbol, bus continuous. Back to this sentence. 
The first action is boss continuous and the second action is boss symbol boss continuous boss symbol First boss playing the um, We can make it in other, other way while I was playing tennis. I broke my leg It's the same the first action was playing the second the interrupted the interruption came from boss symbol uh, notice the comma I used while here we put a comma between the two phrases okay. use remember to use while while with boss continuous and to use when with boss symbol look I was playing tennis when when after it boss symbol while we use after it boss continuous let's play it's a game look at this picture uh, a man and his wife what are they doing and what uh, happened yes they were while they were talking an accident happened or an accident happened while they were talking you can make it in two ways an accident happened while they were talking all while they were talking an accident happened let's see another picture what is he doing what happened he was reading a book when the phone rang when the phone or we can make it in this way when the phone rang he was reading this is the first action and this is the second this interrupted reading we have a final ex uh, exercise in your activity book exercise seven look at the pictures and dry sentences it is the same like the previous one ahmed ride a horse fall off and break his arm ahmed was riding a his horse when he fell off and broke his arm look at Ibrahim do his homework father asked him for help what is the first action Abraham was doing his homework when his father asked him for help Abraham was doing his homework when his father asked him for him Hassan watch TV neighbors the neighbor next door uh, came, come round they came to visit Hossam was watching TV when neighbors came round look at the children playing in the park mother called them yes while the children were it's a regular plural while the children were playing in the park uh, their mother called them Mr. Farah was walking down the corridor when he heard the noisy students. Caroline was doing her house housework when the phone rang. Uh, we have an interesting exercise in your uh, student book, page 15, exercise 5. It's related uh, to uh, hearing sounds and making two actions. It's very, very, very fun. I hope uh, to do it with your friends at school or at your school, at your class. That's all. Thank you for your uh, listening. I hope you enjoyed our lesson.